up? It's your boy Jeremy. I just checked into uh, the Bush Continental Airport. I'm on my way to China right now. Um, total flight time is going to be like 19 hours plus a two hour layover. I guess my announcement on the intercom about my flight. Same as checking passports now. So uh, yeah, we're going to head to Germany first and see you there. Hi, we have to go sideways. It's Haribo und Kinderschokolade. Ja, das ist gut. I'm made it to Beijing. I'm in a taxi right now with my friend Karen, who is pretty Hi. much going to show me how to live and survive in this environment. Welcome to Beijing. So I just passed out for like three hours in the apartment and now we're at uh, number eight mall eating dinner. Like some kind of Hong Kong soup thingy. And we may start eating. I don't know. Some kind of stir fry, right, right Hong? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Before I went to sleep, I just wanted to give you guys a quick tour of my room. Boom. That's pretty much it. Um, yeah, as you can see there's a wall here. There's a wall here. So, uh, my bed is pretty much takes up most of the room, and I also have a desk over here with my stuff, and a towel, a lot of hangers, and uh, I, got, I got a shelf full of stuff. As you can see, I haven't completely unpacked yet. Um, but yeah, today was a pretty good day. Um, I didn't get to check my computer yet, so I haven't been online, or I mean I have, but I haven't really, you know done too much and stuff um, so I'm just gonna sleep and probably try to write a blog tomorrow um, up on my blog spot so yeah I'm really tired now so good night so today my roommate took me to the Wudako mall and I ended up going to the grocery store so check it out yeah I got all these drinks and that ramen pack for like five dollars total the traffic here and the driving is, is crazy, like, I, I gotta try to catch it on camera sometime, like, oh my gosh, there's no words, like, you just have to see. Yeah. <laughs> Great. I've been peeking with my friends from Belgium and Korea. Yeah. <laughs> 
They're all gray? Yeah. Oh, gray, man. Gray, yeah, yeah. <laughs> The playground equipment is painted. I mean, the workout equipment is painted, painted like playground stuff. <laughs> so my roommates aren't here, and no one's eating out for dinner. So I'm gonna try cooking in China for my first time. So uh, yeah, check it out. Here's the ramen I bought. I'm uh, trying to cook this, and uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. Oh gosh. So like, apparently in China, the low setting is like high, and on is like even higher. Like, check this out. Oh my gosh. So, I think it's almost ready. Ta-da! Alright, the chicken came, so let's see what we got. Oh, Kundalati, as you can see. God, uh, oh, these are actually really small. Uh, I ordered some hot wings and a hamburger, so... <laughs> wow. So here are the hot wings. They made it They made it look big on the picture. Look, this is, this is the actual size. They put it like this on the camera. Um, and this is a hamburger. Or a zinger burger, or whatever they call it. Yeah. It's kind of like a fish fillet. Oh yeah, and it comes with hot soy milk. So that's a bonus. Oh, yep. Mm, okay. Very fun sized, but this was all for uh, about 42 quai, which is like seven bucks. And now I'm gonna eat it. Good morning. It's the start of day four of Beijing today, and the air pollution index was at 256. So I'm gonna be wearing one of these masks. Um, yeah, today the, when I woke up, the whole apartment smelled like pollution. Um, and as you can see outside, there is a little smog. Um, yeah, so the pictures in uh, Nine Gag and Reddit aren't completely true. It's uh, it's only smoggy on some days, and it's not like super bad all the time. But uh, yeah, gonna be heading to uh, PKU today for student orientation. So uh, yeah, we're gonna we'll see how that goes. All I have in this apartment right now is that ramen. So I just ordered Chinese McDonald's. I guess I'm going on a Chinese fast food craze right now, and yeah, it's it's on the way. All right, check it out. I got a hamburger, some spicy pork McBites, which it's like little fried pork thingies, and I got boba from McDonald's. Check it. Look, it's tapioca and everything. Yeah, it looks like the portions here in China are a lot smaller than America, but I guess that's the same in the rest of the world. So I'm back at PKU again, on the way to registration. Here we go. is Guanghua School of Management, which is going to be my school. So apparently I was supposed to register in building 2, which is on the north gate, when I was at the east gate. So I'm walking all the way there right now. Uh, hopefully I get it right this time. I'm gonna go eat in PKU's cafeteria soon. You wanna say hi, Anthony? Hi! Hi! We're still setting up fireworks. We're heading to uh, Summer Palace right now to see some lanterns. And yeah, the smog is everywhere. It's insane. It's like 400 API or something. What's up? This is Beijing Day 5. Uh, the weather forecast is haze, as you can see from a lovely look out the window. And uh, I'm on the way heading to PKU again to uh, meet up with one of my Korean friends and take a tour of campus because I didn't really. Uh, get to see a lot of it yesterday. 
So I got lost once again for like the fourth time of the five days I've been in China and now I'm on the west gate when I'm supposed to be my parents at the east gate because the bus went to a different way than he said he would. So now we're meeting up in the middle at the library and I'm walking there from the plus side. I guess I get to see what the west gate's like. I have this scenic tour. It's still snowing and the lakes are all frozen. It's kind of cool. old buildings with foggy trees. Like one of the most Asian things I've seen in my life. Apparently no one knows where the library is so I very well might be trying to find it myself again and so I don't get lost again. Wow. So I'm at the back of the library so I found it on my own. And uh, yeah hopefully we can meet up and get some lunch and Get to our campus soon. Wow, check this out. I mean, I only saw some distance the other days, but this library is huge. Uh, so I found my friend at the library, but apparently all of the cafeteria and restaurants on campus close at 2 p.m. So we're walking into Chongguanyuan right now to try out their cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I found Chinese frozen or Bing Xue Qi Lu. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> come on, let's come and play. Okay. okay. <laughs> There's a Korean uh, PKU college tour going on right now behind me. <laughs> I am in one of the oldest buildings on campus right now, so yeah, check it out. It's like snow on the side. Just Nice walkway thingy. Yup. The English is real. So I managed to find this uh, candied fruit thing that I've seen in like every Asian movie and drama I've ever seen. So I'm gonna try it for the first time and uh, yeah, see what it tastes like. It's apparently it's called sang guo or something. It's like a native Chinese fruit. Uh, we don't have this in America, so yeah. Mmm. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so it was about 8.20 of day 6 right now. Uh, I'm still really jet lagged, but uh, since I was traveling on the plane for two days, I guess you could say this is the end of week one. So to close out this video, I just want to give a shout out to my mom, my dad, and my brother. Um, you know, take care of each other, keep doing what you're doing. I hope you're all doing really well right now. Uh, shout out to my crew, Air Force crew, AFC all day. I haven't found the scene here yet. But I'm going to try to next week. Hopefully I can join the hip-hop crew on campus and then I'm going to um, see where I go from there. Uh, Shout-outs to my Fuse family, Dagger A&M. You know, uh, you know, show me 
what you got when I get back. Train hard. Uh, hope to see all you guys improve a lot in the future. Um, shout outs to the Texas B Boy scene, of course. You know, I'm gonna rep out here as soon as I can. Uh, shout outs to Texas A&M University, uh, Mays Business School, the Reap Exchange program that I'm on. Yeah, thank you so much for sending me here. It's been awesome so far. Uh, shout outs to WCC, CBC, you know, all my friends back home. And finally, of course, thank you to my subscribers. Um, thank you guys for following along. Uh, shout outs to you guys for your long time support of my channel. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you again soon and hopefully entertain you with these videos. So, peace.